right. Let's continue. Do not delete. That was close. Mm, I'm not quite sure what we did last time. Right, we were fighting the... Whatever the nation down in Africa was called. From what I remember. And we're moving it to France or Gaul. with the Helvetii. From what I remember, there's a big... There's like four armies here and or one G Gallic army as well. Gonna suck for us. Okay, they got an army there. I think I want to lure them into an ambush here, if I can. Ready for battle. We'll see. At your command. Let's actually start moving this guy. Mm. Right, they do, they do have two fleets up there. Or, yeah, two fleets and, a, and their king is there. Give me a second, I am streaming 1080p. Might be some issues. Let me just check. to stop and check if everything's okay from time to time i'm dropping more frames or not we're fixing that up oh this is a, is this no it, it's not an intern all right let me check this yeah they can make an attack on that next turn these guys might attack us we do have the two elephants Oh, and they have an army. Ooh. I mean, we're losing public order here anyway, so let's dock them. We have them immediately uh, deployable. Okay, I don't think they're going to be able to make their way over here. Grab all of those, and that's all our money. Speak quickly and well. Speak. Everybody hates us. Expansions minus 74. Yeah, jeez. Hmm. We open up task manager as well some reason like the preview for on YouTube doesn't can't keep up for whatever reason between us Guess we can't do much here. These guys are probably gonna attack the city. I'm gonna be able to. Yeah, 17. Get it. We don't even need a fleet there. Honestly. 
Get three turns on these guys. Don't need to check the fleets from time to time. I'm getting some FPS drops though. Right, I was moving these in case they'd go down here and attack that. Just in case. Let me pull up the stats for myself a little bit here. What's up, Ahsoka? How's it going? What is Drid playing these days? Is he still on Star Sector? Wasn't around much. X3, right. Or X4. Yeah, X4. I'm just waiting for him to play Underrail again. Dang, tiny keyboard. Well, that's why you should buy yourself a laptop. If you're using a phone. I can't deal with phones anymore. That's pretty much it. Let's see if they attack me here. Hmm. Would be nice if you could actually... More laptop then. Uh, here's an idea. Here's an idea. Just buy a keyboard and uh, plug it in, right? Just have a separate mouse and keyboard. And use the laptop as a screen. No only. And we... Would be pretty cool if you can actually set the fleet into ambush. I mean, that's what I would do, like, I mean, I do have a friend that has a, he uses a laptop, but the screen has, is a bit fucked up, so he has the laptop plugged into a TV, and he has a Bluetooth, we're out doing some, well, I guess that makes sense then, he has a, he has the laptop hooked up to the TV, and he has a mouse and key, Bluetooth mouse and keyboard, where he just lays in the bed and, you know, Games that, well, games that way. Uh, he doesn't really game. He uses his laptop that way. Because, like, it's not worth fixing the screen, as per usual. Okay, everything's set. Actually, no. Right, this is the one that might get attacked as well. This is the garrison general, is it? Yes it Yes it is. I think I'm just lucky here because uh, Commander. Uh, does he have the movement range? Kind of. Ready for order. Waiting for more orders. Ooh, the Averni actually moved the army there. I'm just lucky the Gauls and the and the Helvetii are not in a uh, alliance. Or else that would be that would be bad. A little bit. See what happens. Mm, the game may have no, didn't crash. Okay. Let's see. After all these years, we've fought Carthage and we destroyed the elephants. Now we need to face them again. From some nomads in Africa. That's gonna be funny. Like all the, all the troops are trash, except the except the elephants. I mean, even the elephants are not gonna do that much damage. I don't, I don't have the triarii anymore. Yeah, that was really. I'm actually sur like. Considering uh, how uh, Total War games usually work, I was thinking of like uh, that like half the factions are gonna get wiped out instantly. Ooh, nice! I could do some other Total War. I am planning on doing the Lord of the Rings mod for uh, Shogun 2. I just need to play with it a little bit more because uh, you know you play the dwarves. And you think they're gonna work like dwarves in Warhammer, but uh, they don't. 
So I lost a pretty big army to a small garrison. Prophecy of Pandor. I did. Uh, I do. I do, have, I do have like two or three. Prophecy of Pandor playthroughs up. One even uh, modified a little bit. So it's instead of the box empire, it's, it's Roman Empire. Change the troops around. So there's archers instead of crossbows. At your service. Uh, like hoplites, Praetorians, for the infantry. Light cav, well, cav. And for the noble troops, I added in. Where the f My skills are yours. Swift and silent as a Where the hell did the other army go? Like heavy, heavy infantry for the nobles and heavy cav for the nobles, like Praetorian guard. I'm not gonna walk into an ambush, am I? We hunger for battle. Oh, let's. None will escape. We take this settlement for Rome. I'm working on another, like a um, modification of Pandor as well. Basically, I want to do blunt only. Blunt weapons only. So I'm modifying the Pandor faction to have like blunt weapons. But uh, I kind of, kind of have to get the damage down because you need to change the bows to the, their damage, like make it a little bit balanced. March. We cannot pass here. Wait a minute. So was that an ambush? Okay, so it was an ambush. Didn't work though. Trash. Yeah, except the elephants, everything's trash. Hmm. I wonder how good ballista are against elephants. Right? It's going to be interesting to see. Okay, it takes a bit to load. Yeah, I think I found the problem, the performance problem. Something was uh, searching windows on C. Let's see. Hmm. Elephants versus a whole lot of Pila. Who's gonna win? Short or normal shot. I don't think they're gonna hit them, so let's see anyway. Listen for commands and obey as you would your fathers. Then we will maybe I should move him back. Hitting the elephants, but well, maybe I'm um, 100 HP. 100, yeah, I can't tell. It does says it does say they're uh, da yeah damaged by artillery. Maybe we should do the flammable though. So we can actually see if they hit them right.
Uh. Well, that's a bit overwhelming. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. But yeah, the pilum is gonna destroy everything. Am I actually gonna see the elephants actually charge enemies when they're out of control? Oh, nice. Finally. One of our units has used all its ammunition. What are they doing? I mean, if it's going to be a standoff, I'm fine with that. Brave Romans to a man. Advance at speed. Arista. Mars, aid us. Ooh, I hate using artillery, to be honest. It hurts so much when they hit your guys. Okay, they, they actually killed an elephant. Good. How the f... How the fuck did they hit that? That's new. I didn't know the elephants can actually break. Usually that never happens. We're finally out of ammunition. Oh, 50 guys dead. Fuck. No. Nope. Jesus Christ. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Gives us strength. Yeah, I'm not gonna use the artillery like that anymore. How the f Okay. That's enough. Maybe I should have moved them a little bit back, to be honest. They hit the same unit again, even. So these are just gonna break. Brave Romans to a man. Romans ready for duty. The battle is turning in our favor. Kill more. I'm gonna. I took more casualties from my own fucking ballistas than them. That's it's gonna be like that in the end. No, 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 no. Even though they're shit, I don't want to lose Cav to Spearman. One of our units has used all its ammunition. What's up, Juventus? I'm good. I just, I just. My ballista has killed like 60 of my own guys, so I'm a bit, a bit salty. <laughs> but other than that, we are good. What's this? AI actually kind of flanking? Amazing. Could have just uh, charge these. Like looking for my other cab unit. First 
Yeah, these guys got fucked up. Yeah, somewhere around there, like 60 guys died to the ballista shots. Maybe I should... Nah, uh, like, I don't know. if it, Is it worse if I move them, like, further back and then shoot at the enemies in front of us? Or... Like, I'm not quite sure if, well, if, it, it's, if it's gonna make it worse or... Or better. <laughs> We're gonna check after this battle, like, did we get more, uh, did we lose more troops to our own guys, or to friendly fire, or to actual enemies. We do want to hunt as many as we can down. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have uh, targeted the enemy elephants that are right in front of my infantry. Just maybe. Okay, that should be it. Okay, they killed 243... Yeah, yeah, we lost 60 units, basically. Yep. That was bad. <laughs> Good thing I actually activated the flammable shot, otherwise I wouldn't, wouldn't have seen it. guys don't want to attack that. Let's actually move these guys out. Move the fleet up here. Right, let me check this. Yeah, Soka? You here, here again? Is that it? We hunger for battle. Hmm. The problem is if I besiege this... Yeah, there's an army right there. Commander. Ready for orders. Your next command. Okay, so they have a full stack here. Eh? Is that uh, if that's a link, just send me the link, like directly to me, in a PM. The glory of Epona, whatever that fucking is. Probably a goddess or something. So yeah, they do have us. Let's see, two full stacks. Mm, almost three full stacks. Yeah, you need you need to PM me the link uh, in the chat. It's like uh, they removed. I serve only Rome. And I think Druid will do anything if you give him enough money, right? Well, maybe not. <laughs> maybe he's not the masochist. If it's awful. A salmon smoothie. Someone did mention that, like, in a stream one day, once, one day, a million years ago. I think. Skill targets reduce map movement speed. Yeah. Moody gave a man dysentery. Ugh. Well, I mean, if you have problems with, ta with taking a shit or constipation, 
Maybe it's worth it. Worth it. <laughs> Who knows? We hunger for battle. Here we want to ambush the enemy. Let's see. 65. I guess I can move this army up. It's moving for the vaccine. <laughs> yes. You need to send me uh, the link. Uh, PM me the link. Okay, I see it uh, on uh, the Streamlabs chat ball thing. 16 year old man volunteered to drink a dysentery smoothie. Uh. I mean, for the greater good, right? <laughs> Someone has to sacrifice. I think I think I'm gonna give this a read later on. It's a fucking long. Uh, peace. Uh, I can't remember what it's called in English. Let's see, I do want to lure them into an ambush so I can actually take that out without getting a backstab because these are actually kind of good heavy melee infantry. Yeah, we hunger for battle. Sixty percent ambush chance. What about you? At your command. Hmm. I could also. Maybe lure them into attacking this if I hide this guy. What's your chance? 60%. Make haste, men. Waiting for orders. Advance. Hmm, not quite. Yeah, they're not gonna make an attack on us directly, so we need we need to ambush. Can't really make it all the way over there. I guess we're gonna let's just set two armies into an ambush stance here. We cannot pass here. Playing an ambush, sir. Sixty percent. Ready for orders. I wanna try and ambush this guy with this army. Ready for further orders. How very un-Roman of me, right? Trying to get the, all these ambushes. Let's get the gold farms. Public thing. Alright, move the, this guy back. Lest he get fucked. Ever in service to Rome. Ready for orders. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with this army. I guess I can ma Hmm. Got an idea. I could use this army as a bait and place the other one into an ambush. Place this one into an ambush. Yeah, probably that's gonna that's gonna be. I need to lure them away from that. Is it, I mean, their armies are not that good, but uh, if they throw enough shit at us. We're gonna crumble. Check down here. Does besiege, he can't move. They actually stopped raiding. Good. You are gonna have a rebellion here. Ah, we can cover all of these with a single fleet. That's not gonna be an issue. Let's get those up. Mm. Let's upgrade these first. Okay, that's it for our money. No low ups. 14 plus 13. Yeah, it's gonna be a while till we get the, that up. What's the problem here? 
Right, our taxes are on the highest. Yani, Gorska, Africa. Yeah, they say I was gonna look into like which buildings do we actually need to get for the public order to be nice and great. Man, I never did that. Not much else we can do. My question is, is this guy gonna... Hmm. Medium phalanx, heavy phalanx, heavy melee, heavy melee, heavy shock. He might not move against us here because this army is there. We'll see. the AI is like dead for this like past couple of turns for the goals at least like they have two fleets and an army sitting in the in the ocean not moving anywhere just starving out there I mean the AI all in all was a bit passive here They're gonna sally out and attack my army so I can wipe them out and uh, take less losses taking the city. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, we might have some uh, issues with the amount, amount of skirmishers they have. Not that we are going to take a lot of damage, it's just going to be a bit annoying. Good, we're going to be able to take the city like on the end turn, probably. If I can actually chase, uh, chase all the archers down. to like move with these guys a little bit faster because uh okay oh, that's a bit fucked they'll have a supply train or baggage train He's on the flanks. I'm not sure how many turns can we be in a village before we run out of supplies, though. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Make sure they are not ashamed. Oh, this poor general is gonna get destroyed by the ballistae. How about you stop firing because, because he's just gonna charge? Okay, maybe he's not just gonna charge straight at us. Chad, get a Mantians, don't need a fucking saddle. Who needs that?
Legionaries! Legionaries! Melee troops awaiting orders! Legionaries! Hmm, they should look nice. I think it's codename Panzer 3. If you click on the units a bit uh, too much, they're gonna get pissed off. <laughs> That's like the, the, one of the coolest features they can add into the game. Yeah, they're gonna take their sweet ass time getting here. Oh, what the f... What the f... How the hell did that happen? Get behind the fucking lines, please. Target the archers. Romans, ready for duty. Legionaries. One of our units has used all its ammunition. I do love the AI in this game. Look at that. Fucking input reading. for them to actually get here before I move the cab on them. No, 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 no. Look at that. These guys got wrecked. Like, I'm not sure if they might have got, uh, got a rock in the back. Okay, now we can charge them. Guys, for firing. Double time! Melee infantry, your orders! Missile infantry! Legionaries! Search to Mars! Advance at speed! Legionary cavalry! Ready and waiting! No, 
Yeah, I'm also thinking of doing a Tilla with the Imperium Praetoria mod. I kind of want to do that to Corp because it really is meant to be played in Corp, more or less. Or maybe I should have used my general as well for this. how battles work if you have the like slower combat mod or sub mod for this there is a faster combat mod as well but uh, I don't think you want to grab that battles would go so freaking fast you can do you can pay attention to everything Charge them. General is a missile, medium missile cap. What? I guess it makes sense. Romans, ready for duty. Let's get him out of here. He's new. He's young. He's supposed to live. Watch it for them. They do have another army somewhere in the desert, which I'm, it's gonna be a pain in the ass to actually catch them. I don't wanna do, I don't wanna take desert attrition to be honest. The enemy general is dead. They actually get these over this way, so we're gonna lose someone to Jalens. Is there like five of them stuck in the middle? I guess those are the leaders. Signifier and all that.
improves the defense against cav and flank and infantry, but reduces attack of the unit. Yeah, of course. I mean, this would be good if you were surrounded. Or outnumbered by a lot. I like most of the time you don't you don't actually use half of this stuff. Which is kinda unfortunate. I did fuck up with the bullet stays there a little bit. Just a little bit. Not too much. And did we wipe them all out? Yes, we did. Noise. Ready for orders. Yeah, it looks like they didn't take the bait over here. Well, I mean, uh, well, there was no bait. Mm, one of the other parties has organized a banquet in your capital, threatening your homogeny. How do you react? Attend. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, that uh, rebellion might be an issue. Sixteen turns to go. Oh god. We hunger for battle. They're gonna run away, which is the worst spot here. Ooh, they're not. Noise. Okay, the, uh, okay, this guy's actually on a chariot. The Dread Nomads. And so far, streaming at uh, 1080p seems fine. Like even Twitch is not giving a fuck that it's higher bitrate. Hmm, should I camp the hill here? Nah. Nah. Fuck that. Let's keep these guys in the back. I think I lost more troops now to the attrition, to be honest. Yeah, this fucked up again. Uh. Yeah, not like it matters much. Just out of range. Hmm. Like figuring out which, where's, like where's the, like what here is passable or not? Eh? I mean, we could camp up here. Don't give us much of an edge, but still. Actually, let's use these on the flanks here. Double time. Ready and waiting. Legionaries. Advance at speed. 
have the peel. Kill the elephants. Doesn't seem like we hit them, to be honest. I do wish there was uh, like an accuracy sh stat on your troops. Ammunition. It looks like the film did, did the damage. Okay, nice. You shoot there. Actually, you keep sh keep shooting at the elephants. Is there general actually like no let's let's cherry ooh One of our units has used all its ammunition And they're Egyptian chariots the kind of I wonder how okay 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 okay, okay. stop 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 Oh, my calves actually gonna be able to deal with these. Yeah, it says low threat, let's see. Fucking easy. Yeah, that, that was something. Granted, this is like a fully leveled general, so they get a morale debuff. Chase down one of them. Chase down the other. Legatus! 
You are not gonna catch that cow, no way, no how. You come back. Medium spears, eh? I wish they, someone made a mod or they made something in the new Total War where you can just click uh, like chase down enemy fleeing units or something. It, it is really annoying like clicking on each one of these, especially once they like break up and are all over the place. Red. What's up? Hamzat? Hamzat? Hmm, I'm not sure about the Ballista, to be honest. Might be, might have been better if I took a uh, Scorpio or two and one Ballista. Oh no. Oh god damn it. At your command. Get the stakes up. Uh, oh fuck you. We hunger for battle. Oh, we're gonna take a shitload of attrition. Chasing them down. That's what we're gonna be. Plus, I need to change that one down. Let's uh, sabotage this one. We can't run away, father. By my hand, it is done. Let's not tax this for a turn. Get them out. Them as well. We hunger for battle. 80% ambush, ambush chance. Don't mind if I do. I do need to move Ready one of these. Ready for orders, Commander. Over here. Ready for orders. Advance. Lying in wait. Let's see if you can lure them somewhere. Right, get this army close enough. Very fair percent. Come on. Light force, sixty percent. Yeah, that's what we need. Your next command. Surprise will be ready for orders. You want to place this as bait? Is that all? You there! At least that's the idea. Okay, that's set up. Fleet is there. Mm, we want the FT amphitheater. And let's get the medics. That's about it. 
go right level ups. Yeah, no wonder we're not making as much money. I lost all my uh, signatures. The priests. Oh god damn it, he's he's like standing a little bit off the road. But then I do need to check. We have a couple of guys that need to be married. Right, maybe I should check the women too. Mm, that's about it. Seem, let's increase. Mm. Let's send the diplomat. I think uh, the Egyptians are still going to be the biggest threat if we go to war with them. So let's send her out there. See what we get. went past two ambushes what the fuck I mean he's dead but still well, that's a bit dumb oh. I don't get an army can't move through your zone of control either way so how the f what? Oh, this game doesn't make sense sometimes. Oh, shit. I guess that's where the Averni army is. I mean, I can now resolve this. We're gonna fight it. Now we do need to fight this, making sure we're not going to lose too many troops so we can actually take this city up there. At least one of my baits worked. Okay, okay. we can hold, the, hold them off with that one. Hopefully all the reinforcements are going to spawn behind them. Like, not like from multiple ways. The defenders of the hills, the stone crows, the heralds of death, and the glory of Epona. Versus Legio 5. Iowa. Iowa. Something like that. A Legio 13. Polonari. Napoli. Polian can't say it. So it does actually spawn your guys like on on the side that they're gonna come from. 
was wondering about that. Also, we're gonna place these guys nicely behind them, but uh, there's a tent in the way. It actually would be better if the garrison army came in first. Our reinforcements have arrived. A heavy burden, but it is a proud one. Now, two arms. Advance and speed. Oh, don't tell me they're gonna. Yeah, they're gonna get stuck there. Discovered the enemy's hidden units. Romans all. You know we're getting some garrison units out. I want to use them up first before I do anything else. Fucking defensive position, these guys can can't They're not wide enough. They're not fast enough to get around all that. One of our units is yeah, well, let me just uh get these guys ready. Actually, I'll just rush them here, then I'm going to split them off. Used all its ammunition. So much for the cav. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, at least one of their generals, generals is gonna just run into us. Actually, maybe even two. Okay, now we can uh, form the defensive of the studio. Now these guys don't have uh, their melee attack is pretty decent. I'm just wondering, do I just place them there in the defensive line or attack with them? One of our units is 
used all its ammunition. Yeah, let's place them in there. Good thing they don't have any trebuchets or something. And they don't know how to flank either. Okay, let's move them a little bit up. Yeah, okay, the FPS goes down to shit when you look at that. might go down to our own friendly fire from the towers. That's not gonna be... Uh, it's not gonna do much to us, but still. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Fuck are they doing over there? Yes. Actually, since they're out, let's just uh, toss the peel up. Kill count's gonna be on this one. Yes, it's shit. And these guys are winded already. That's not good. Let me actually start splitting these up already. Frightened by the enemy. Sure, I could move by. Uh... Yeah, let's move our uh, cab onto them. But there's a uh, mop up their archers real quick. Looks like some of our walls are gonna go down.
slave Romans to a man. <laughs> they might have ran out of ammunition before I get to the to be honest. To use that'll be less days though. God, there's just so much shit. Let me start splitting these up as well. I think I'm actually gonna move these behind the enemy. Because they're gonna have, I think they was how much was it? Like uh, there was two full stacks, no, three full stacks, and a little bit of an army, I think, something like that. that it would be nice if uh, we could actually kill them all but um okay I mean, it's not gonna be enough for that There's more of them. Uh, yeah, there's definitely two full stacks. Plus uh, another one, more or less, I think. Time to see how much time do we do these guys need to like replenish or get unwinded or untired. Yeah, we knocked out their archers. Good. Good idea to actually place some units. Uh, let's see. Romans ready for duty. Let's grab one from here, one from here. I 
like place them here on the edges where they can escape. So place them there where they can escape. Squeeze this one through here. Brave Romans to a man. In the name of Rome. Advance at speed. We can already start lobbing shots with these guys. I can't. I can't I just. I don't want to do that. To be honest. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Outside. Now we're actually gonna have a mil uh, legionary unit break. That's a big surprise. Okay, let's try and get these guys through here a little bit. Actually, we can just move this guy out. Let's see where these shots land. I'm actually curious. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Kind of on target. No, no. Hey, this is so fucking stupid. Why did they design this map like this? Thank you. 
This guy's ran. Looks like the walls are breached. 186 kill. 183 kills. 126. Oh. Oh. Okay. Never mind. You stop shooting. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Oh, oh, look. Oh, that one shot just landed straight into our infantry. Line. One of our units has used all its ammunition. They're actually capturing my tower from the inside. Best. Let's move these back around real quick. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Sneaky bastards. Just turned into a marsh pit. Ready for Wait, what? what? Sons of Mars. To yeah, you just stay there as well, I guess. At this point. Fox, I don't even want to know what the hell is happening there. Apparently we're losing the capture point as well. Oh, some way. It's always nice to see. Just a bunch of enemies just squeezing through your lines like nothing. Tell me I'm gonna lose the battle because well, that's gonna that's gonna be something. We only got like three guys in there. Well, five. Good. Ready and 
waiting. Heavy cavalry ready and willing. Riders at the double. Looks like some of the enemies are squeezing through my lines again. No, I see. This is a problem. They have phalanx units. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, we did, we did make their numbers count for nothing, but uh, we also did that to ourselves a little bit here. Men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. That fucking captured or not? Come on. Okay, there we go. And getting more reinforcements in. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Let's actually tell these guys to flee as well. I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be using them, to be honest. I don't want to get my archers uh, cab in there. No, no, never mind. There we go. That's that's it. And we just need to slaughter them all. Funny how the game, like, gains more performance instantly when the AI doesn't need to like make. Uh, Make moves. You want to kill as many as you can here. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Yeah, it is shameful once we actually won the battle for you to flee. What the fuck? Yeah, the friendly fire damage from the towers is really annoying. Yeah. It'd be cool if you could actually command the towers like you could in Shogun 2 and just like tell them not to fire or something. I 
We killed 7,000, and they only killed like 1,600. Uh, the KD ratio, man. <laughs> I don't think we did have almost the same amount of troops on the field. lost nothing on this army as well so we're nice and ready to attack their city over there okay, we wiped out two got two armies and these guys got like a one unit left great They ran away from that, to be honest. Just keep getting uh, settlements off of the Egyptians. <laughs> uh, research all of that. guy can't move for shit. Yo, let me check this. Commander. Yeah, hold on. We hunger for battle. Did I not place these into an ambush stance and how? Look at, the, look at the zone of control on these. Like, how... Where did he pass? Makes no sense. I think he's dead anyway. I wonder where the other army went. Hiding there somewhere. Okay, with these two, command. we can uh, besiege that, I guess. At your command. We hunt. Let that power before, before we didn't have a lot of battles, but now, now it's just a battle after battle after battle. For battle. I guess it just took a while till we got all the armies up. At your command. At your command. 
Do I want a sandwich? I think I do. Ah, uh, 81%. Yeah, let's fight it. Almost clicked on an auto resolve. see how good am I, am I going to manage the sandwich. Maybe I, maybe I should like look, look into it. I hope there's a mod that actually includes the room one music into this. That would be nice. Enforcement are gonna get there in time to be honest. Except the cab, I guess. That's not good. See the see the black on the unit cards. What the fuck's happening there? has used all its ammunition. Romans ready for duty. Ready to run. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ammunition. I don't think I don't think we're gonna get to sandwiching. Unfortunately. Cavs actually holding on quite well, considering. Commander, 
your service. Heavy cavalry ready and willing. Do want to break him? Otherwise, they might charge something I'm not looking at and kill my general, for instance. They just ignore my infantry line attack, the other ones in the, in the flank, yeah, that makes sense, AI. Especially once you, once you have a whole other army coming your way from behind. used all its ammunition. Well, I'm not sure about the Gauls having phalanxes, it doesn't seem... Like it may be historically accurate and all that, but it, 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 it makes fighting them a... Any, fighting anything... Well, I guess fighting a phalanx with something else than Rome might be a bit of an issue. Since all our units are melee infantry, well, well, very heavy melee infantry, it makes things a bit too easy when fighting phalanxes, to be honest. Unless you get outnumbered by them and you can't actually flank them, then you're a bit fucked. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that wasn't good. have more friendly fire kills which actually uh, wish the game actually told us that the only 20 22 friendly fire kills not too bad look at that their one army had 4,000 units for men well two of ours only have 6,500. 
Make haste, men! We hunger for battle! Advance! Big march! Okay, next we got two more fights. I don't like uh, the game giving me Memphis one bit. That's that's not gonna piss him off no freaking way. <laughs> the diplomatic mission to, to them uh, Tinker is the. Decreased our relations with them by seven. Guards of the afterlife, spare my ass. That's not good at all. These guys are actually spread all the way down here. I don't know how exactly. They are at war with most of the Gaelic factions, the Bretons as well. up here first For Rome! yeah all oh. uh, right I do have to fight this manually so we don't lose I mean I'm gonna disband those units anyway but still you must use them wisely Enforcements have arrived. Honor and bravery to match. And I know that you will not be found wanting. Now, the hour approaches. Mate, ready. Not sure if they're going to come at us or not. Uh, they might. We do have... Celery. Units has used all its ammunition. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Me, you want to charge? Okay. Amount of kills on the ballistic. Romans, ready for One of our units has used all its ammunition. We await your command. Ballista. Thank you. 
One of our units has used all its ammunition. One of our units has used all its ammunition. What's up, Andrew? How's it going? We just missed a whole mess of a fight. What's up, John? Who this? Who this? This is a guy who plays uh, DVD Tempera. Maybe a little bit better than Andrew for now. Just had a mess of a battle of it, like four. Well, it's not four armies, like two and two and a half stacks attacked my fourth with like five units in it. Plus, um, a reinforcing army because, of course, it's taking me a lot better. Well, I am older, so I guess I had more time in total war, right? It would make a bit more sense. And I do really take this slow. I like to make sure I'm never gonna be in a fucked situation. That's why I do a little bit better. The battle is turning in our favor. <laughs> Brutus, even you, Brutus, really? <laughs> John being Brutus in this one, right? What the fuck are these guys doing? That's my question. Let's just flank them. Left him for a girl. <laughs> Well, I mean, um, I mean, if it's a girl, then it's okay, right? Could be. Or a loved one, I should say. I'm not going to assume anyone's preferences, right? Maybe, maybe this is why I do uh, better than Andrew a little bit. Like, I'm fighting a fucking trash garrison army and I'm still like cautious about stuff for the most part. Hmm, I wonder who that is. Thanks for the 50 dollar, uh, 50 euro donation. Oh, come on, don't get stuck on each other. Andrew has a mission. Uh, granted, I didn't, I didn't really play a lot with the... Uh, Hellenic factions, just because I don't like uh, phalanx units. Like... I like my flanks, man. See you there, Sammy. Mr. Big Bat. I, I should really start saving the replays for some of these battles. Well, granted, it wasn't like a, an epic battle, but it, it did just take a shitload of uh, time to do something. Dimus Maximus is here, alright, as well. You gave up on Battlelord, Sammy? Why is that? 
Phalanxes are the most OP in Rome. Well, that's the thing. They are great. They're amazing. If they don't get flanked. Yeah, that's that's the issue and they do like they're good for defending but they actually like taking on units they're shit at it that's why i don't like them i don't think banner lord did, uh, the, the the eagle rising mod didn't get an update for banner lord yet it, it did it we're still just waiting for that right this is siege battle so fuck that The KD ratios are amazing. <laughs> I do remember playing uh, a lot of Attila, and uh, you know, a lot of uh, you want to grab a, 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 you know, the, not the phalanx units, but like the pikes, which are kind of like the phalanx, you know, the mercenaries you can grab. And it, they're good at defending settlements as long as they don't move an inch. They move an inch, they lose instantly, break. Upgrade to 1.7.1 in two years in the game, and everyone but me is broke. Yeah, I did notice that the uh, lords have less troops for some reason. Maybe the 1.7.1, to be honest. I'm not quite sure, though. I didn't really look at the patch notes. Yeah, see ya, Andrew. 4v1. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I do say I, I don't get myself in a shitty situation. Like, uh, there was a Averni army hidden somewhere here, and uh, the Helvetia I had uh, like a stack and a half. I placed this army into into wide open place there with a the fortification. And I placed this, this army behind it in an ambush, and I lured them in there to a fight. Where can we actually, like... Right, if we can't like look up what happened, At your command. Okay, you just At run least. back. Ready for order. We cannot do that. That is impossible. Ten turns, Jesus Christ. And another thing the Andrew missed, you want to have generals, but just sit them in the in the city. And then just give them uh, the capable bureaucrat and right till sovereign rights. Those are the like governor focused one, I guess you could say. Play on rest. Now let's give him that. And also, you send diplomats everywhere because you get a whole province from that. All of these are like from me sending diplomat. I even got Memphis from just sending a diplomat over to Egypt. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking stupid. God damn deserts. No wonder that the Romans had like trouble expanding to the east and here. Just fucking deserts everywhere. Yeah, get one more turn to fix up the public order here. Right, then we have this siege battle. Mm, the casualties are here are not that bad, but let's do it anyway. I was extremely lucky with this play too. I haven't gotten declared war arm by everyone. Even when my standing was a bit shit. Which was. Romans! It's 
drop that shit. We don't need that. Hmm. Where do we want to attack from? I mean, the reinforcement army doesn't have a ballista, I don't think. So let's uh, destroy here. Destroy the walls here. Or just fucks up your general speech every time. We have reinforcements coming in. Yeah, let's uh, get the hole there. There. accuracy shit on these and they're wetter and five as well okay, let's get all of these here Pissing everyone off. Oh fuck. Destroy the wrong thing. Because they don't fix the sieges. They fuck around with the game, but they don't fix the, like one thing they really need to. Fucking beyond. Then again, this game also has a pretty good amount of bugs. Pretty bugs as well. Ammunition. Where are the ballistas? Okay, no more ammunition, get them out of here. with only two entrances. Oh, this is gonna be a fucking slog. Actually, this is gonna be a slog. Let's try and, and get th through the gates. the enemy's hidden units. One of our units has used all its ammunition. One of our units has used all its ammunition. If 
only I can get like a couple of units like through there without them getting stuck. I don't think that's gonna be uh that's gonna happen for me. I mean Sammy, if you're around, you could try the blood and musket. Yeah, I think blood and musket. Blood and smoke mod. That's guns. It doesn't fix the issues, but makes the game a little bit more fun. Especially since... Oh, shit. Since there's explosive ammunition. Which makes sense. But... And a whole lot of smoke. Yeah, this... Could have out-resolved this one. Made more entrances somehow. Come on. Gonna be able to do. They have spe yes, they do have spearmen, of course. Why would they not? Although, although Andrew did try play this on the hard difficulty or very hard difficulty, which one it was. I mean, the game is pretty hard. I'm not uh, surprised he had a hard time with it. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You have to cheat to get the. Uh... I do. I don't have fill stacks on, and they still don't don't get like a decent amount of troops. And of course, they never have food. Real freaking annoying. If you use true limits, how, I guess would that fix the problem. Maybe not. The enemy's gates have been destroyed. Well, see, we're not even destroyed yet. Can't rush in with these guys. Used all its ammunition. Uh, I guess, uh, I mean, Sammy, that was always. Oh, the game just crashed. <laughs> Out of nowhere. That's nice. I think I actually saved. We can out resolve it. I mean, the AI cheating was always a problem in the uh, battle, uh, well, not battle lord, mountain blade in general. In most of these games, you can't really get the AI to do decently unless they cheat. But even when they cheat, like even in the prior versions, they always run out of food. And if you use the like uh, surrender, surrender tweaks mod. Where the AI can actually surrender, that makes it even easier. We're gonna alter all this this time. I mean, even here, the Vidente Para actually like makes the AI a bit smarter. They like, they like still dumb when it comes to a battle. Well, a campaign as well. Like, like the only solution I see for these kinds of things is to actually play head to head, like for, for total war at least, is to play it head to head with someone else. Ready for battle. It's 
basically at this point. Ooh, look at these sneaky fucks. Ready for orders. Because even like pushing off, uh, pushing up the difficulty on legendary just makes the things harder at the beginning. Like the only good way to actually make the game more difficult is play head head, I guess. But uh, <laughs> that is a problem as well. If you're not used to playing versus people, like versus the actual players, you you get you get screwed. Especially like in Warhammer, I played a little bit with uh, Megs. One of the guys are playing Roman I with, and he I slaughtered him just because he used the same tactic as like you use versus the AI by just having a lot of ranged units, and he failed. It was like a bunch of savage orcs because I just rushed them. So you definitely want Empire Maintenance. Yeah, get that down. Replenishment. We're gonna attack that next turn. Oh, how many turns? Six. Okay, we can do that one. So I think, uh, like, people like us, we're... We basically need to play versus each other in some of these games. Or maybe we should get into... We should start Old War Room 2 once. You never play... Oh, come on, man. It's a pretty decent game. A bit easy, but I mean, if you play with Rome, of course, it's going to be easy because, you know, the infantry is just that good. They can hold the line and all that, and the morale is pretty good. But if you play like... Uh, I don't know which faction is like the hardest. I think Macdon. Macdon is a bit hard, or the hardest. Because uh, you're surrounded by Hellenic factions and they, for the most part, hate you. But if you find room, uh, room 2 vanilla too easy, just install David and Impera. It's going to make things a lot harder. Or one of the other, like, total conversion mods. Radius. Or what was the other one? Uh, I forget the name. You can look them up there. They're, like, the most popular ones. Or we can play head-to-head. -head. So each battle is me versus you. Let's see how far we get. I'm gonna attack skill. Losses, campaign movement range. Charge bonus. Get the threat commander up. And we need a logistician. Ferocious warrior. Armor for all units. I do love seeing like one of the like look at this. Look at the nostalgia. Room one portrait. <laughs> Check the portrait. Okay, what else? What else? That guy is gonna starve. This guy is gonna. Okay, he's not gonna starve. Ready for battle. Okay, these two can move next turn. Hmm. I thought the Averni had like more than this. Looks like they only have like two more settlements or something like that. to go to war with these guys before I take out the rest of Gaul. This is a bit annoying. Not much we can do. 
Minus five. This is gonna make things even worse. Okay, that's all our money. Let's see if we can marry the last guy here. Not yet. Everything else. Ooh, we can send someone on a diplomatic mission again. Let's we'll see if we can get another settlement off of Epirus. That's gonna be funny. We got one, two, th we got three settlements off them for free. <laughs> That's so fucking dumb. Ready for battle. Okay, this since these guys are just gonna sit there. Let's get that. Public order. Uh, I guess that. Okay, Empire maintenance. And research rate. Okay, that's everything else is fine, I think. We've got some food problems, but that's gonna be fixed up. We have a decent surplus. Right, we did take this this is pretty much Roman let's get this up and Romanized I mean I, I I go back each year and play most of the Total War games a little bit or a campaign or two although I mostly play uh well, uh, the problem is, like, I can't play Rome 1 anymore. I just can't get the game to run perfectly or smooth. I guess they're... Uh, ooh, look at that. Their fleet is actually moving. I guess I should buy the remastered one. Remastered version of it. And it would be nice if they actually remastered Medieval 2 then again as well. Which one's the best of war? Sacrifice to Ares in the hope of a short war, even though I yearn for your suffering. Oh, this is gonna suck if Sparta joins. Okay, they didn't. Good. Uh, the best of war, now by popular opinion, is uh, Warhammer. Total War. Still Warhammer 2, just because you have the whole map and all the factions from 1 and 2. And you have a lot of diversity there because, the, you know, the factions are real, like, uh, different. Well, uh, there is no remaster announced yet. Or, the re like, uh, but I assume they're gonna, like, remake it or remaster it like they did Rome 1 at some point. Turin. I, I, I do say, like, that the, the, the whole War Warhammer is definitely a lot more enjoyable because every faction is totally, like, different. If you know what I mean. Like, I guess you have uh, the Empire and Britonia. They're both uh, human factions, but they still play a lot different. A generous tribute. Nice. Jesus Christ, so many... Ooh, noise. Finally, the reform. Get them in there. We'll see the desertion. That's them. Child is born. Natural causes. We hunger for battle. 
Lucius Mus. That's a fucking name. Oh, this annoying fox. I mean, I don't see a reason why would they not like remaster the game. So I'm gonna need to move these armies back up. Greek to Greece. Let's bring these down. Get them ready to transport. Okay, now there is actually a slight difference between these. So it now, now it actually might be worth having the veterans. Yeah, they got three more melee attack. One more melee defense, two more charge bonus, weapon damage up to 28. A decent amount of more uh, of... Uh, Morale. I still don't think the eagle cohorts are ye that good. Just makes them a bigger target, to be honest. Damn, that costs a lot to reform them. We hunger for battle. Right, right, right. Let me check. So, plebs. Loretari. Plebs as well. Okay. We hunger so, we can recruit units. Let's see. Yeah, let's see him. Imperial Cataphract Legion. What? Wars of Cata, Cata Germanica, Imperial Veton. Wait a minute. You'll be. These veterans are of the wars in Germania have been called forth from retirement, have re chosen have chosen to re-enlist and serve the Roman army again. Like the difference between them is uh, ten more morale, and they're both veterans apparently. Wars Aquila, legionary. So you don't want to make these, right? What's the difference? They're actually worse. The only, like the only difference is nine more armor. That's not worth it. And we can finally make oranges. Nice. Actually, let's recruit them immediately. I guess at this point, it's more of a, like a, an aesthetic thing. Which one you want to grab? Let's now watch. Milton and Javelin, man. No, no, not Ballista. Recruit with him. Ready for orders. Call this a garrison. I'm actually gonna keep this army. I never know when these guys are gonna declare war on me. Okay, actually, a recruitment zone here wouldn't be such a bad idea. 
point. We hunger for battle. Commander. Jesus Christ, it costs a lot. Can we get... Oh, shit. Well, this may be bad. Yep, well, I'm not going to be able to make it there in one turn. Then again, the garrison is almost fully replenished. Start taxing some of these. Okay, not this one. That's going to rebel either way. We're going to get slums there, definitely. From the 110. What the hell did these... Well, that's a fucking surprise. And the Bretons made it all the way down here. Let me just check something. I will listen. I cannot say for how long Free money for matters of state and a splendid bowl of olives demand attention. Hey that uh Sparta didn't join their war. I accept and gladly. So they're gonna accept peace. Yeah, that's funny. Although the problem here is once we take care of these factions up here, the Hellenic world is going to declare war on us, most likely. We're going to need to move, shift some armies over there. Definitely. Should get more armies now and more governors. Yeah, we're gonna mess with the governors next time. Don't actually have the ca uh, we do have some cash, but not that much of a surplus to mess about with that. Oh shit. Yeah, let's hope we don't get all, all of those into slums. Out of all the total wars, I think you can have the most fun out of the Warhammer, to be honest. Especially if you grab all the DLCs, there's so much like a diversity there. You're gonna have a lot of time, like you're gonna spend a lot of time, like like you can, like only the humans have like a couple of starting positions. And even though they have a couple of different play styles, if you go with the uh, Hunt, ma Hunt Master's Expedition or something like that. I can't remember what they're called exactly. Then you have vampires all over the place. Then you have 
Dark Elves and High Elves all over the place, Tomb Kings, like, and they all play a lot differently. So that's why, like, yeah, Total War Warhammer still has the most amount of players. I wouldn't suggest playing Total War Warhammer 3, though, yet. I think, I think it's still bugged as all hell. Hmm. I think we can stand to lose uh, some of that. Let's go with public order. Wait a minute. Had a rebellion, and we're gonna have another. Ooh, what the? Ooh, what the fuck game? Ready for battle. Okay, we're gonna move you to deal with that. We need. I need to move this guy. Oh god. I guess get on the ships. Move them over there and fast. Now, are they actually at war? No, they are not. And they're not all allies either. Right, let me deal with this first. So don't forget. Well, let's deal with that. Commander. We're gonna lose a shitload of troops here to attrition. Agents, they never work. Commander. Okay, we can get this guy back here. Hmm. I'm not sure how good their fleets are, to be honest. I was uh, moving another fleet over there, but... Um, I think I got them hung up somewhere. See how these new guys handle them. I don't think one of my alerts worked. Let me just check something. This sound didn't work, but the fucking alert didn't. What? I'm gonna deal with that later. Uh, these are the veterans. Cohort! 
Again we face battle. We will be tested by the gods, as we have been so many times before. And like all of you, I will do my course, there's wolves near the Romans. For all we were Roma. Rome, uh, Rome. Uh, without wolves, there would be no Rome, right? We all know that. Sons of I don't really like the look of these shields, to be honest. I do want. I am gonna recruit a couple of those cataphract guys. I do want to see how they look. I mean, I know a wall. I don't think I read anywhere that there were cataphract infantry. I got a decent amount of kills, 200 each. Nice. One of our units has used all its ammunition. I mean, the range on the peel toss is freaking. Amazing. One of our units. Total War Attila is also pretty decent. Uh, the problem with it is like uh, the perform, like the optimization was shit for it. They're just gonna sit there. Combat even versus light spear infantry. Oh, that's what I want to see. Riders, One of our units has used all its ammunition. 
ammunition. Rolling down there a bit. Their king, their general is medium spear infantry. No wonder they're losing. Heavy horse at your command. Equities. Heavy cavalry ready and willing. Uh, yeah. I mean, the, granted, this is a. Uh, Village battle, they only sell it out. This is, this is gonna be pretty easy. Not all their units pose a threat. I mean, Sammy, if, the, if you're there, we could do a co-op campaign as well, if you want. Hello. I don't really know which faction would you do. We do that with. In Realm. I mean, you're like, because the idea is to be Roman, right? I mean, well, if you played any Total War game, it's pretty much the same. You just need to flank. That's pretty much it. You just flank. Spend the enemy morale. Although the, like, uh, buildings, like, it's... it's the, I would say it's complicated, but it's not complicated on campaign map, because you only need to, like, learn which combination of buildings you need in each province to actually stop it from revolting. And having, uh... sanitation issues and uh we can play a co-op campaign like not uh, head head but a co-op where we you can just give me control of a couple of your units for a battle yeah! so it's not head head Commander. like which factions I guess Rome and something like a uh, the Lucids or Egyptians? Well, like, I take the Germans, right? And go up there. Destination reached. Yeah, that should be fixed up real quick. I can't remember which one I want here. Okay, one with the uh, gold talents. Yeah, I played a little bit uh, a couple of days ago. I did one of the the set dungeons. One of them was I couldn't do it because uh, I did too much damage and killed all the enemies instantly, and I need to bleed ten of them. Renton, which is real nice. I did manage to win one with the uh, uh, with the ray course that built a my skill. What is it called? Uh, like spear throw or boulder toss one. And now I need to do all that again to finish like the seasonal things. <laughs> okay, let's get the upkeep. Well, so uh, yeah, some of the shit that you need to do is b b beyond insane at this point. We 
And it really is RNG. Like, I, I couldn't get the master level for the boulder toss one just because there wasn't enough enemies around. Or, I mean, I left a like a couple like i think i think i needed seven more kills and i would have gotten the like the master level of it i just missed some enemies somewhere okay these are moved everything is moved I do need to still keep an eye on the fleets. Actually, I could just do this. Organize games. And her to Africa. See if she can fix it up. A little bit. Yeah, kind of. Now the problem now for me is uh, there's a shitload of tests coming up to call it on college, and then the, a bunch of essays need to be get, get done. So the, like uh, May is gonna be a bit shitty for me. Is Julian just a wee bit? I don't want to get this. Down here. Guess I should make more governors. We don't have the income now. Let's see. Minus two. Minus one. Let's actually look at the ones that have, don't have enough food first. Okay, everything there is being built. This unit cannot upgrade because either reform has not yet reached Imperium level, purple technology not... What? Or proper, not purple. But... Oh, it says... Pro what? I'm confused. Let's bring him here, see if we can bait him out. Sixty-six percent chance to get an ambush. I'll take it. Ready for orders. March. Your next command. It's gonna be a bit shitty. Can these guys reinforce? Yes, they can. Good. Right, I can get more dignitaries. Possibly. Yes, I can. Two. Ooh, nice. Two more. I need to save up the money for that though. Plus seven. No, that's not gonna give us any money. Neither is this. Or not that much actually. Let me see if we can lure another enemy into an ambush. It's gonna be it for today. I do love it when a neutral army just uh, kisses my ass as I move around the world. Worst part on Diablo 3, I do really want that extra stash slot. But getting all the set dungeons done, oh my god, that's gonna be... 
Okay, I even watched uh, a couple of videos on how to do each one and it like no way. No freaking way. Ooh. Nice. Now, funnily enough, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been surprised if the Bretons actually joined them. And the Iceni. Let's find this. I'm not exactly sure why they are attacking. I mean, I can also resolve this. are not showing up the sound is showing up but the Thank alert is the not king, showing baby. up on screen that's nice Sons of Mars. we were fighting uh, fighting the barbarians in the heavily wooded area what could possibly go wrong for the Romans? speech again where okay behind them yeah I just suppress the uh, I don't want to do that because I don't notice when they're actually targeting my general I want them to die from random shots Breaking, apparently. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Wait a minute. Where the hell is their general? But you gotta appreciate, uh, appreciate like the pilum getting stuck in the, or the spears getting stuck in their uh, shields and it like bouncing off their shields as well. Brave Romans, to a man. No more One of our units has used all its ammunition. Although I still think this thing kills and all and the are better in the older Total War games.
<laughs> and, and like the banter between the soldiers too is <laughs> real nice. Yeah, this is a field battle. I need to knock out most of them. Okay, there's their general. Medium fail. What? Okay. How much for their general, I guess? He's gonna get screwed. up there. Stop chasing the cab, goddammit. They're just running away from us. Medium spears. Okay, don't want to fight those, that's for sure. Consider them high threat. Maybe they're, these guys are not as good as they thought. The auxiliaries. Ready and waiting. Ro 
Bowman, ready for duty. Rifle. Orders. General. Threat just charge him, I guess. Yeah, look at that. These are these guys are crawling pretty well, and of course they're gonna get caught by something. Yeah, look, the naked warriors. The fucking run, man. What the fuck is that? Okay, I mean, I see why. These are Greek hoplites, I think. Half, half Hellenic hoplites. I don't know anymore. problem with the Diablo game or the any Diablo game games is that they get like the end game is just a grind there's not much to it that's basically it let's charge these down That's like a why I found Warframe a bit less grindy, even though it the game is literally a grind from the start, more or less. Grind for materials. Resources. The enemy general is dead. But it's not as a... Uh... Well it is, you just uh... Just, there are classes where you can just click a couple of buttons and uh, kill everything on the on the map or on the screen in your close vicinity. Well, that's the problem with those kinds of games, I guess. You get to um, come to grind fast. They are okay. We did lose a decent amount of troops, but it wasn't that bad. The like ADE ratio is much better. 3,223 kills versus there's 445. Because the idea for the Diablo S games would be to play most multiple of them or switch them around. Like when a new season comes out, you play Diablo, then you play Path of Exiles, it gets a new season every three months, I think. Then switch to something else. There are a decent amount of them that get updated regularly. Yeah. On a regular basis. And they just left their capital undefended with that. I'm gonna leave that for next time. Go 
for uh, I guess uh, for uh, Diablo, you got to be, you got to get to the next, uh, next, uh, next torment level or uh, great rift level. Look at that, from a 0% risk of war, civil war, wait a minute. Oh, I think it's the scripted civil, civil war, oof, oof. I don't need that in my life. Even though it says 0 here. Yeah, the more damage, the more better. It, the Gens Papyr has a risk of secession. Let's uh, secure the loyalty. I don't want to have a civil war. Yeah, this is one thing you need to pay attention in Rome too, I guess. They made the po politics a lot more annoying, to say the least. It's Greeks. <laughs> it is an honor to serve Rome. Well, to do more damage, you just need to get the... Uh, get the... Get the... What, what, what was I about to say? Better gear? The same weapon, same everything, just uh, better stats on them. Or re-roll a million times like I do and have no luck and still get the, sh the shit you don't need. I'm gonna get so much desertion shit. Well, this is annoying. Yeah, I guess more Paragon levels always help. Do that. I actually get the... Uh... Let's recruit a couple of uh, the cataphracts here. Two of them. And one more javelin. See how they look. So, how would... How are gonna Paragon levels work once the season ends and the... The amount of Paragon levels you have in a season character, do they merge with the Paragon levels with the on your normal character? Or how does that actually work? Success in all actions. Okay, next turn I'm gonna attack this. The hell's the other one? Okay, this makes sense. This is connected with this up here. Jesus Christ. Okay, let me just check if you can actually deal with this fleet. Yeah, see a semi? Well, it's, it's easy. If you played any Total War game, uh, you just need to like learn what the buildings do, basically. That's about it. And never do the never never play this na uh, naval battles. Never, always auto resolve. That's one thing I'm gonna suggest to you. The waves still beckon. 
Or I don't know, maybe you can, uh... Uh, the naval battles and the naval... I mean, I sent you the video. I can, you can look it up. You can look up the video I sent you on in chat on uh, battle.net. See what happened with the in, uh, with the n n land invasion force. Plus, uh, the ships bug out a lot. And, well, I never learned how to actually play or do well with the Navy. So uh, that's why I avoid them for the most part. Right, we want night battles. We can't get them this turn. Yes. You that they start building a military warfare it's like I knew. Like at the start of the campaign, I did fight us naval battle here, and I lost half my fleet because I, I just didn't, didn't know how to deal with them. Deal with the navy, to be honest. It was a bit easier in uh, all of the samurai shogun two full of the samurai, just because uh, you know you have guns on the ships. Well. I mean, you don't want to use anything else but the ironclads. It kind of worked a little bit better. Ready for orders. Five turns there. Okay, but yeah, I'm gonna end it here. So see a semi. I mean, you you try the naval battles, like do a custom battle and try a naval battle. I just suck at them much else to see. <laughs> oh, God, grow to all provinces. Well, let's get to all this first, then we're gonna get to everything here for next. Nine turns and 700 denaries. Nine turns at 523 research speed. Jesus Christ, game. Anyways, thank you for watching. I good morning, good day, good night. See you next time. Thanks, Sammy, for the 50 euros as well. You're too generous.